Hi, welcome to What's Happening. Here are the top five stories. At number five, President Muhammad Buhari has directed the incorporation of the Nigerian National Petroleum Company Limited. Buhari, who is also the Minister of Petroleum Resources, gave the directive in accordance with Section 53, Subsection 1 of the Petroleum Industry Act 2021, which requires the Minister of Petroleum Resources to cause for the incorporation of the NNPC Limited within six months of commencement of the Act in consultation with the Minister of Finance on the nominal shares of the company. The directive was disclosed in a statement released by the Special Advisor to the President on Media and Publicity, Femi Adeshino, titled President Buhari Directs Incorporation of NNPC Limited Appoints Board. The statement revealed Ifani Ararume will be chairing the board, while Melekiari and Umar Ajia were appointed as Chief Executive Officer and Chief Financial Officer, respectively. At number four, the Governor of Lagos State, Babajide Songwolu, has approved the appointment of Bolaji Oregba as the new General Manager of the Lagos State Traffic Management Authority. A statement signed by the Lagos State Head of Service, Hakim Muri Okunola, says the appointment of Oriagba is geared towards the continued efficient and effective traffic management of roads in Lagos State and takes immediate effect. While congratulating Oriagba, the head of service urged him to justify the governor's confidence in his appointment by rising up to the occasion while bringing his wealth of experience to take the agency to greater heights. At number three, gunmen have shot dead three police officers in Anambra State. The armed men attacked the police officers around 9 a.m. on Sunday and also set ablaze their operational vehicle. The incident took place along the Ukeabu Ezeiweka Road in Onicha. It was gathered that two other officers were also injured in the attack. The police spokesperson in the state, Ikenga Tochuku, confirmed the incident to newsmen. At number two, a former deputy governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, Obadia Melafia, is dead. Melafia died at the age of 64 on Sunday morning from an undisclosed illness. His death was confirmed by John Hayap, an associate of the deceased. Recall that last year during an interview with Nigeria Info Abuja 95.1 FM, Melafia had alleged that some pardoned terrorists revealed that a serving Northern governor was a Boko Haram leader. After the meeting, the Department of State Services invited Melafia for questioning based on the allegation. At number one, President Muhammad Buhari has arrived in New York for the high-level meetings of the 76th session of the United Nations General Assembly. Buhari arrived at the JF Kennedy International Airport in New York at about 4 p.m. local time on Sunday. The Nigerian president would be the second head of state to address the high-level session of the General Assembly on the fourth day of the general debate at about 9 a.m. local time on Friday, September 24th. He would speak on the theme of the conference and other global issues. Always remember to wear your mask, wash your hands and stay safe. That's all for now. See you next time on What's Happening.